Hey there everyone, it's Val, and welcome back to Tolkien Craft 2, The Labors of Valentine. I did some arguing with uh, Thomcraft today. Yeah. Um, well, I've already been through Thomcraft before and done all the research the hard way, the long way, the old way. And the new way, I don't really like it to be quite honest. I had a hard enough time getting adjusted to the old way. I finally learned it. Just for some reason, you know, every now and then you get something that doesn't want to click and that that does. This one, this method, I find annoying, tedious, and laborious. I do not feel like memorizing what makes up Lima, so if I see it on here I can try to connect it with aspects. I understand the theory behind it. You take like Ordo and then you take Vitreus which is composed partially of Ordo and you put Vitreus beside it. Then we got to find something that has Vitreus and the things that make up Cognito and eventually bring it down here. I do not want to have to keep uh, flicking in and out of my book here and the research table which is what I was doing. No. Um, this, this is the, the default for, uh, Token Craft 2. Uh, I don't know if, I know, uh, Great Orator hasn't gone through all the config files yet, at least at the last time I spoke to him about it, he hadn't. So I don't know if he is going to leave Thaumcraft using this or not, but I am going to switch to the way in which you come in here, as long as you have the research points, you click on whatever it is, and it spends the research points and you learn it. Skipping this part entirely. I do not enjoy this part. I am skipping it. <laughs> but just for clarity's sake, this is a change that I'm making for my own personal use. Whether or not Great Orator decides to make the change for the pack, it's up to him. Of course, he may intend the long, longer way to be the default, and that's fine too. A lot of people enjoy it that way. Uh, I don't happen to be one of them. And uh, I'm going to change it to suit my tastes. And I'll try to remember to mention periodically that I've made this change to the config file so that I don't experience frustration and annoyance. Alrighty. Uh, isn't the sunset awesome watching it from here? Ah, oh, wow. I'm really glad that I did that window. Anyway, let's go back upstairs and take a quick nap so I can show you the other thing that I've been doing today once I got frustrated enough with Thaumcraft and stopped uh, scanning everything that's around me. I was hoping to get uh, to the point where I could at least make the goggles so that I could see the nodes easier, but yeah. Later. And if you look over here, you can see we have our farm started. I had been debating about whether to put it inside the mountain or not, and I finally decided... Where's my bat? There's my bat. finally decided I was going to put it outside. I think it's going to grow down here as long as I'm in the base. It should be within range. I mean, it's, it is really close. It's only a couple of chunks away, so... It's not fenced off or anything yet, but we do have the basic ground lighting in, which you'll see when I hit that. You can see that the farm area is lit with uh, notches of glowstone. Where did I put them? Oh, I put them away. Notches of glowstone beneath gra gla or grass covers, which you create uh, through microblocks using a saw. In fact, did I put the saw away too? Of course I did. I didn't put it in my backpack. Anyway, it's a diamond saw. <laughs> you can make flint ones, you can make iron ones, but I just made a diamond one. I have planted the witchery stuff. Uh, I have done absolutely zero stuff with witchery, but I do know we're going to need things, these plants, from there. And I also know that you have to be very careful with mandrake which is... where's the mandrake? That's sweet potatoes. 
Where did I put that? There's the mandrakes. This row here is mandrakes. And I planted the water artichokes in the handy water that we've got around here. Mandrakes. I believe you are only supposed to harvest them during the day. Otherwise bad things happen. I think it's day. Don't quote me on that. You, if, if you're new to Witchery, go check that yourself so I don't, I'm not responsible for an accident. All I know is that you have to harvest it at a particular time so that interesting things don't occur. Right. Well, that's about it. <laughs> Thomcraft uh, stuff and a farm. Just looking for my outside window here. There it is. There's our... Uh, I haven't looked at it from outside before, so that's why I thought I'd come around here. Looks pretty cool, doesn't it? <laughs> Alrighty. I think I'm going to finish up the tour today. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the tour, and I hope to see you in the stream sometime. Y'all take care now. Bye!